labels we give ourselves published this month about the fluidity of partnerships and how families today come in myriad shapes and sizes. She co-founded We Advance, an organization that creates a grassroots movement empowering Haitian women to collaborate towards making health care a priority and has appeared in Coyote Ugly, The Cooler, A History of Violence. Are you kidding me? Thank you for smoking. I'm on other movies. She's being interviewed today by Los Angeles Times columnist Sandy Banks. Ladies and gentlemen, join me in welcoming Sandy Banks and Maria Bello. Hello. Hello. Is that my position? Welcome. I'm, I'm really thrilled to see so many people since we're the first session of the morning, so thank you all for coming. Um, I know a lot of you may come, may be here because you know Maria Bella as an actress. Um, in my family, Coyote Ugly is her, um, her, her mark of fame. Um, but she is also now, she's become, I think, probably even better known for leading a national conversation about love, about labels, about partnership, about how we make connections and what we call them and what they mean. Um, she, read, she wrote a piece uh, for the Modern Love section of the New York Times uh, about a year and a half ago almost. And it wound up being the, I think it was the second most clicked on piece in the history of the, of the paper. Um, she got 270,000 responses within the first hour. How long came to be and whether you were so surprised by the response. I have to say, I read it. And it really moved me. It felt like a message because it, I could relate to it on personal levels. Um, and I was astounded that somebody would be kind of so clear about it and so brave and so, um, uh, just so honest. So uh, tell us how it came to be. Okay. Um, first of all, I am so blessed to be here today with all of you on my 48th birthday. Um, this has been one of my biggest dreams since I was 13 years old to write a book, and I wasn't sure what that would be. Um, I was inspired by something my son said to me to write the New York Times article. When I told him that I had fallen in love with a woman who was my best friend and a godmother to him, he said, whatever, Mom, love <laughs> is love. And from that moment, I started asking myself questions. And it led to more and more questions. And the feedback that I got, the people who wrote to me. Um, one woman said, my best friend lives next door to me in the next room. My ex-husband lives in back. We all raise my children. And when someone asked me, do you have a partner? She doesn't know what to say. Because she doesn't have a romantic partner at the time, because she didn't have a business partner, but she does have this family and partnership. And that's what I have with my uh, modern family. <laughs> 